Always helping others. <gasps> I heard you are not feeling well, best friend Bear, and I thought flowers from my garden might cheer you up. Thank you, Cher. You're the best, most thoughtful friend ever. That sure is nice of Cher. <laughs> Yeah, Wingnut. Something is the matter. I feel sad. Like I don't count at all. It makes me feel kind of jealous, I guess. <laughs> Look at Funshine. Always helping bears out with all kinds of fun stuff. Everybody thinks he's great. And Cher? She's always sharing and making everyone feel so good. Tenderheart's an amazing ball player. And there's Grumpy. He's a great inventor. He can build and fix anything. Let's face it, all the other Care Bears are special. But me, I'm just a nobody. I feel unimportant and unspecial. I know everyone loves me, but nobody ever gives me any attention or congratulates me, because I never do anything interesting or brave or special or... Whoa! Except to have oopsies. <laughs> and there's nothing special about that. I feel like nobody even notices me. <sighs> Hiya, Wingnut. See what I mean? The library is a great place to read, isn't it, Cheer? It sure is. So relaxing and quiet. <gasps> or at least it was. What's going on? I gotta patch the Fring Dinglin Library roof before the next rain. Don't want the books getting wet, do we? Uh, why don't we go to the waterfall cloud to read? It'll be a lot quieter than here. Just once, I'd like to do something that would get me some attention. Make me feel special. Lucy, Lucy, hey! Thank you! Thank you all so much! Thank you! Thank you so much! Whoa! a close one. A real heartbreaker. If it wasn't for Oopsie, we would have been clobbered. That was so brave, Oopsie. You saved us. But I really didn't do anything. Oopsie, you're a hero. Hero? Me? You bet you're a hero. And everyone's gonna hear about it, too. That's well, I tried to tell them it was an accident. They called me a hero. Way to go, Oopsie! I heard how you saved Harmony and Cheer. Flowers for a hero! Oh, uh, thanks. 
but... Hi, Oopsie. <sighs> nice going, hero. Imagine that. Me, Oopsie, a hero. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. It was just an accident. I'm not really a hero. But if they all think I am, then what's the harm in... You think it'd be dishonest of me, huh? I should tell everyone the truth. Sounds like everyone's gathering in town square. <sighs> I'll go over there and tell them what really happened. Surprise! <laughs> uh, oopsie. Is it somebody's birthday? The party's for you, Oopsie, for saving harmony and cheer. Don't you just love all the decorations? We can't weed, but can we have your autograph? Okay, everyone, just like we rehearsed. For he's a hero, Oopsie. For he's a hero, Oopsie. For he's a hero, Oopsie. That nobody can deny. It was nothing, really. I just did what I thought needed to be done. <laughs> I know, I know. I'm gonna tell them the truth in a minute. I am doing a story on you for the Heroes of Carolot website. How about a picture to go along with the story? My picture? On the Hero website? Wow! <sighs> what went through your mind right before you sprang to the rescue? I, uh, really wasn't thinking about anything. Ooh! He acted without hesitating, thinking only of helping others. The true mark of a hero. I'm gonna tell everyone the truth, but couldn't I at least wait until the story goes on the website? Okay, you're right. I'll tell them the truth right now. Uh, everybody, I've got something to tell all of you. Tell us at the library. We've got something to show you. Okay, Grumpy, we're all here. We all decided we're going to replace the heart that fell off the roof with this statue of you, Oopsie. <laughs> I made it myself. A statue of me? On the roof of the Smart Heart Library? Nope. From now on, it's going to be called the Oopsie Library. I'll just make a new one. Nothing's too good for a hero. Look, everybody. I really, really have to tell you something. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, that's true. Really good. Shh, shh, shh. The hero is gonna make a speech. I'm not a hero. And I didn't rescue Harmony and Cheer like everybody thinks. I had an oopsie. Just like right now when I knocked the statue over. Uh, he He's saying the whole whoopsie doodle thing was an accident. Then why didn't you tell the truth? I wanted to tell the truth, but everybody was calling me a hero. It made me feel good. I felt important. Even though I didn't deserve it, all the attention made me feel special for the first time. What do you mean? You are special, Oopsie. You've always been special. Yeah, and there's no one else like you. Yeah, right. Because nobody else is tripping and falling all the time. That's not what we mean, Oopsie. What's special is that you're a great friend. And fun to be with. And kind and helpful and always there to share a smile. Well, you did break the statue. Grumpy, be nice. Okay. <laughs> no harm done. Guess I got a little carried away. It felt good to be thought of as a hero. And to almost have a story about me on the Heroes of Carolot website. You know what? I'm still going to write a story and put your picture on the website. 
because I think you're an even bigger hero now. Huh? Why? For telling the truth. That took a lot of courage, and that makes you a hero in my book. <laughs> Come on, everybody, one more time. For he's a hero, oopsie. For he's a hero, oopsie. For he's a hero, oopsie. I know he's going to Thanks, guys. <laughs> wow. <laughs>